Hey guys, continuing on with the uh, Zenith videos. I'm gonna mention the landing gear uh, on these airplanes. On the main gears, there's two types uh, that were designed from the beginning. Uh, on this one, it's what's called the square tubing, square landing gear. I know this one doesn't look square, but this is just a shroud, aerodynamic shroud. Inside, um, above, is the square tube, tube or yeah, where the uh, uh, shock absorbing pucks sit. Uh, so when, if you're, let's say, thinking of buying one of these airplanes and you're, uh, you know, one of the points that I would check here is at the back of the landing gear. Okay, let's see. This square panel, there should be one on every airplane. When you open this, you have a view of the rest of the gear that's inside the wing. Uh, the reason why I mentioned the landing gear checking inside the wing uh, is because I know of uh, one of the members here at, at, at the club. He has uh, CH200 and it, he flies a lot and it has a lot of time on it. And he uh, discovered that as the, the leg sits in the bracket up in the wing, it started developing a little bit of slot, right? So you want to keep an eye on that uh, because the only thing that's holding the whole landing gear in the wing are two screws that hold it in place. There's nothing inside the wing that holds it. It's just uh, it's a perfect f uh, fit, almost like a friction fit that, that sits up there. So that is something you want to check, especially if you're looking for like if you're looking at a high time airframe. 